hello this video that I'm doing today is on how to add um, album art uh, to your music inside of your Android uh, music player now I'm actually going to use two separate music players to demonstrate um, what I'm actually talking about uh, but the first thing that um, we can look at is um, what it looks like when you have an album that doesn't have album art. Um, if you look as I'm scrolling through, um, if it has album art, there's a picture and um, when you press play, When you press play, it displays, right? But if it doesn't have album art, it plays and it just has this gray um, music sign here. So I don't like that. Um, when I play my music, I like to see pictures. I like to see the pictures of the artist. I like to see, I mean, because it's it's going to be displayed anyway. I mean, so it's better to me to have a picture of the artist than rather than to have a picture of um, Celeste. So let's see it. So you have her playing, it's a picture of her. Have them playing, picture of them. I think that's nicer. It's easier to actually see. Um that your song changed um, when the artist picture changes okay so uh, and then I'm going to demonstrate um, some of the reasons why you may need um, to change your um, album art like for instance if I play one of her songs um, Um, her picture was really, really dark, and uh, it wasn't clear, so I got another um, another picture for her. Um, if I go to my other music app here, um, one of the things that um, with this one is you can actually choose inside of your settings um, whether you want to use your album art or whether you want to... Uh, get album art for metadata now it does one or the other um, which uh, this is the Neutron music app but with my standard music player it does them both so it automatically does um, the metadata but if the metadata is wrong um, for instance here let me go back and show you how it can be wrong so let's go to folders and I'll go down to Tamala, Lan Tamala Man and we can go back to her. If I do update album art, it gives me this L veneer perfectly imperfect, not Tamala Man. So then I want to use my album art. So I select use my album art and so it uses the album art um there's another um cd of hers that does a similar thing um uh, i think it was this one if you say you want to update the album art it gives you a totally different artist. The metadata is just wrong. So in order for that not to happen, I have to revert it to what I've downloaded, the photograph. And um, on this player, I have an artist here who um, I can show you.
sign an artist if I play his song it's very very blurry um, and pixelated and to show you even further it uses the same photographs in my widgets it's even in my widgets um, pixelated like that so um, let me see I can go back to another artist so that's pretty much the reasons why you would want to uh, download um, album art for your um, artist so I have an artist here um, that um, shows art here and um, when you play his music here his photograph shows but when you play it here when you play his music here it doesn't show up so I mean as you see it doesn't show up on the widget they come up blank all right so um, to me that's reason enough to download a uh, metadata but one of the reasons is because I'm using my album art and I didn't download any album art from him. So let's go into downloading the album art. Um, I personally like to use Chrome um, when I download photographs and pictures. Um, and the name of that CD was um, Bacardi uh, Core. Is the introduction and so we want to put his name and the title of the CD so that it comes up um, the albums come up now I like this picture I think it looks real um, this one here if you look at his hairline and stuff it looks really photoshopped and um, his makeup doesn't look that great to me in that one. And then this is another image that I'll take to demonstrate um, what you can do um, with them. So now that I've downloaded them, I have to go to um, my downloaded folder. Um, where I have my downloads and I have to change the name that's the first thing you want to do so since that's the album um, you want to call that album with a capital A um, art with another capital A and small with a capital S so you call it album art small because that's what will that's what will show when you play the song then I can come here to this one and rename that folder and that's what will show when I pull up folders or pull up his name in the music player this is the picture that will show so the next thing we want to do is we want to take both of these pictures and we want to move them to his folder um, in the music album so we will move them over and his name is Bacardi Cortez with a Z and we just press paste and we paste them in there um, sometimes it takes a second for it to take you can exit out and go back in and see um, one of the ways I know I noticed that it took is the pictures the songs um, take on the picture so like you see how these have music notes, but if I come here, um, 
all of the songs have his photograph. If I come here, all of the songs have her photograph. Um, sometimes it takes a second. If not, another way to just check it would be just to play the music players. So you come to the music player, and it always showed here, right? And so then the next thing to do would be to come here to this one. And to see. Um, and you probably have to um, force close all of them. Um, because sometimes they have to start them all over again. go back and see. So it's starting up again. And the music art is not here. Um, and it's not even showing in the um, well that is how you do it. Um, it's not showing here for whatever reason. Um, but it, it should show up looking just like that. And, um, now he has the album art. It should come in. The only thing I can think is that, um, the applications need to be, like, completely closed. But, um, Neutron was closed. It even rebooted when we opened it back up. Um, I can only tell you that every single, almost every single artist that I could show you in my music collection, um, all of these pictures, um, I put there. And, I mean, the number one way I can show you is by taking you to their folders. And there it is, pictures. These aren't album covers. Um... If you look at the pictures that I use, it's not an album cover. It doesn't have any writing on it. Um, that one I didn't do. Um, but this one, like I can show you two different pictures. So I have this photograph that I use, and that shows up. That's the small album art one that shows up when the music plays. And this is the one that I use for the folder. Um, so let's see if at least that demonstrates properly. See? So that's the folder. Um, I can't blow it up or anything, but you see that that's it. And then when I tap it, that's what plays. So, um... The best way to do it would be to, like I said, and in some of them, I actually did the same picture um, twice, like, um, and the same photograph says folder and also album art, uh, and the best way to do that is to take a picture that you've downloaded, and when you rename it, instead of um, cutting it, you just copy it. So go into your download folder, um, and if you have a picture here, I don't have one in my download, so I'll just do it from this photograph here. So the best way to do it would be to take a picture that I have if I want to use the exact same one, and select it, and instead of, um, cutting it, I just, um, copy it and then paste it in here and then I can go back to this one and change the name and so that one says album art small I can change the name of that one to folder and then paste it in so the same photograph could be used as the folder and the album art 
and um, ultimately uh, that is what we want because when we play albums in our music players oh it just came up look at that it's showing now so it just took a second and now when we play it it shows and it's in our widget so it does take a couple minutes um, it did never take it never took that long before but you know what I was always doing other things while I was doing it so I don't know exactly how long it took but as you see it's now doing what I designed it to do and so we can go back as well and um, we can look and now this other photograph here in the top left corner is what shows that's the folder photograph so that shows until you get into the album and then once you get into the album and play it um, this is the photograph that shows here this one and it's the name of the album and him so um, so now you see for yourself that that is how you change your um, photographs and get pictures to show up in your music players um, and all you have to do is your music player is set automatically to um, use the metadata like I showed you here all you have to do is go into it and um, all you have to do is go into it and tell it to revert the album art so like with this it's the same so if I reverted it ah that's the picture so that's the picture I actually chose as what I would want to come up when it plays um, or we can update it and it'll put back their original cover so I hope that this video helps someone and thank you for watching bye bye